now that we're done with step number four, let us focus on step number five. Let us go back to our instructions file and read what it says we should do. Okay, so it says uh, for the second slide, change the layout, choose office theme, title, and content. Okay, so that's the very first thing that we are supposed to do. In the content section, uh, type this information. Okay, so if you've been following my videos, I am totally against typing. It's time consuming. Uh, I prefer that we simply copy the text and paste it wherever we are supposed to be. Okay, so let us go and and change the what the layout of the second slide to title and content. Okay, go back to your PowerPoint presentation to go to the second slide. Just uh, click on it like this. Okay, these are your slides here. The second one, it's actually numbered number two. Just click on it. They said we need to change the layout. Okay, to change the layout, these are the options here. Okay, so click on this drop down menu and then select title and content. Okay, I think they had already selected that for us. Okay, so after doing that, they said uh, we need to add some text here. So let's go back to our instructions file uh, and then we select this text here. We copy the text. Uh, if we want, we can simply select everything to be honest let's just select everything copy uh, take it to this slide and then paste as text only uh, you'll notice that it had uh, it, it has actually added some boxes here you'll have to delete that manually okay so let's delete this uh, and then delete this one and then delete this one and then uh, delete this one I hope what I just did did not ruin our sound okay and then you go back to your document this is how your information is supposed to appear okay you'll notice that the ICTs in government there is no bullet point at the beginning so you will go back to your working file Okay, and then delete this one here and then you'll also notice that they use different uh, types of bullet points okay then select everything here and then go to your bullet points options and search for something that looks like what you saw and in this case this is what we saw uh, the second thing that you must notice is that uh, here they have they they have uh, increased the list level if you can uh, tell this one doesn't start at the same starting position as the ICTs okay so this is going to be fixed by simply highlighting the text uh, where you need to increase the list level and then you click on this one here and you'll get something like this okay so if you look at this and compare this uh, with the information that you see here the only difference is that uh, the citizens you uh, see two citizens and uh, it's in one line here but on our slides it seems like it's uh, okay it, it is in two 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 lines okay there are two tricks that you can do first you can attempt to do it like this and you'll notice that it doesn't work okay uh, secondly you can simply change the size okay change the font size uh, to something that will give you exactly the same look as this one here okay so we have done that okay so now it looks exactly the same don't worry about the color they're just highlighting information just like they did here okay so we are done now with step number five 
uh, we can then move on to step number six.